Hey guys, so today we're going to be talking about a pretty interesting constraint, right? So we have this linear drive assembly. Uh, notice that the left plate over here is moving freely and so is the right plate. Um, now what I want to do is have these plates move in relation to one another. Okay? So what I'm saying by that is if I go towards the base here, I want the right plate to move that same distance. In other words, have some sort of symmetry between them. Let's go ahead and take a look at the constraints and see what we can do about that. Adding a constraint then, right? So if we cycle through some of these constraints, we see that we have the mate, angle, tangent, insert, and then the last constraint that we have is the symmetry constraint. Right? So if we click on the symmetry constraint, we see that it's asking for three selections. The first selection that I'm going to choose in this case is going to be the face of that plate. The second selection is going to be the face of the second plate. And now it's asking for some sort of symmetry plane. So I created this plane to be exactly center to these two base plates here. Let's go ahead and select that plane there. All right. so notice that you can either have the symmetry flip or opposed, which is what we want. Once we hit OK, if I move the right plane towards the center, notice that the left plane is also moving towards the center. Right. So that's been using the symmetry constraint. Hope it helps.